All right, so how's it going, everyone? I don't know if I should start off with playing this. <laughs> well, we're going to do some more Sicko Snap. Let's see how this goes. I think there's, a, I'm pretty sure there's an achievement tied to, like, completing this. Good shots. Um, I don't remember all the controls. It's been a minute since we've played. That, that looks like a Sicko. I don't know if it's, like, score-based or just completing it. Nothing. Oh, whoa. Oh, that one. What the hell? Shots came out real nice. I'll do better next time. I think we missed one. That's gonna count. It might just be like I forget what the achievement is. I feel like it's just take a picture of every sicko or whatever. Shabby. Shares a video nice. showing the like best. Shots came out real nice. Or like where they all pop in at. That's a sicker right there. What is this route? We're at 15 of 40. I feel like it should be 16. Wait, I'm pretty sure we've only missed one. This one's kind of tricky. I might have missed more. I'll do better next time. Yeah, this one. Dude, these damn sickos. Got to be in the one there, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna be each one. Well, that's a dog. I need to step it up. Baited. Well, there's one up there. Oh. Came out real nice. too shabby. I think. I guess it only counts good. That, which I guess makes sense, but. Better next time. Done That's a palm tree. Aloha, aloha. Could have done better. Not too shabby. I'll do better next time. Aloha, happy guy. I feel like there'd be one up on the screen. Also, I just now notice it's like you have limited amount of Good pictures. You are close. Is that what? Is it Professor Oak and Pokemon Center? Shabby. Could've done I tried nice. that new Pokemon. I mean, I played some of that. What do they call it? New Pokemon Snap? Shabby. It's like the worst name of it. And it like... I don't know. It was weird. It was just like a game. <laughs> you know, I gotta get it all oh, look at that guy just. Good enough for me. That guy probably needs nice. help. I know he's a sicko, but he's like literally just hanging on for his own. Too shabby. I swear if we just miss one. I missed two. What the hell were the other two? Some great shots. What's the achievement? Also, yeah, it's very... Was it late at night or early in the morning? Because <laughs> I want to... <clears throat> I keep saying I want 100% the game, but I mean 100% the game, like, achievement-wise. I think these are extra completed all sicko snap courses. Took 30 different... Oh, that's that one. Okay. But it's like at the same time, I kind of lost all my want to do it because it's like you literally have to pay twenty dollars for the damn 
New Game Plus if you want to get all 100, like the 100% achievements. It's kind of mega whack. I mean, I get... It's like they're counting it as like a DLC and it's not a DLC, like... Like a DLC to me is like adding new content. That's... You're just playing the same content. It's just harder. <laughs> you're like, you know, like... I don't know. I don't know what... Like why they would I'm gonna put you in your think that's I don't know. I like clearly money, but I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna buy it, even though I'm literally loving everything about this game. Like I think I got like what, like 71 hours played? Yeah, huh. almost 72 hours. Well, we're probably at 72 hours now. Um, not quite, but close. We're at like six minutes in the recording. Um, yeah, I'm like absolutely loving this game. We need to go over here, but first, I kind of accidentally did the Tamizawa. They're calling it Drink Wink or whatever. I just kept doing it. I didn't really know it was going to be like a story sort of thing, but it's like. Basically, we help Tamizawa find his wife, kind of thing, and like resolve that whole thing. I didn't know that was gonna be a thing. I probably yeah, drink like. I didn't know it was gonna be like a whole big deal. I thought it was just gonna be like some stuff. Hey there, Chief. This is an achievement. It's actually an hey, achievement to do it for like drink? all the characters. Sure, I guess you get. Join you. But yeah, it's like voice cutscenes and stuff. So. Back in Japan, yeah, kind of did that off never recording. Never drinking but. alone with a guy. Now here we are. No lie, that's kind of surprising. I'm not just a guy. Change when you got here. Well, the first time we met, it was just us at Akane-san's place, right? Yeah, and you drugged After me. After that, it was Dwight. Dwight? As in Barracuda Dwight? Do you know any other Dwight? All oh, right, you, you tried to make your way into District 5. Kind of reckless to go about it alone, and in a rough place like that, too. <laughs> hey, I might be the sheltered daughter of the Fujinomiya family, but I was trained in self-defense, you know. I had a great instructor. Yeah, that's great, that's but they I got guns and shit. An instructor? Yeah, Tendasan. I call him my cramps, though. He's been there for me ever since I was born. Oh, he's about to let you say. What kind of self-defense did you learn from your cramps? I don't know. He taught me a bunch of different things. I think he tailored the lessons himself to work best for me. He made sure I could incorporate different dance techniques I learned, like from ballet and stuff. Okay, so that's like her fight style After thing. hearing all that, it's clear you're real high class. My parents yeah. basically left our upbringing in the hands of other people. Most everything I know, I learned from them. Tendasan's here in Hawaii, actually. Came with me as a chaperone, sort of. Wait, then isn't he worrying himself sick over you right now? Yeah, probably. When I first got to Hawaii, I met him from time to time. But nowadays, I've been telling him I'm too busy, and that he's got nothing to worry about. <sighs> Bet that made him worry even more. I do send him updates, though. Like, I'll shoot him a message saying everything's okay. Well, if he found out about how you've been kicking ass with us this whole time, he'd definitely flip. <laughs> right? How old is this guy, anyway? 77. Well, you sure answered that pretty quick. Only because I just sent him a birthday present. Wait, what? I've given him a hard time, so I figured I ought to gift him a little something. Like, it's so what you know. Like, you're not gonna, it's not gonna, like, she's gonna pause. Here, have a look. This is Tendasan. Cute old grandpa. I, I can kind of see how tough he must have been, you know, back in the day. Well, he's long past his prime. Even I think he's gotten smaller over the years. Uh. Gotcha. He used to travel all over Japan to train. Don't know if it's true or not, but when he was in Hokkaido, he once sent a bear flying. Oh, sounds like a tall tale to me. Wait, is that from one of the previous Yakuza's? Because I remember... Oh, wait, is he going to be... Cool. 
Because I've watched my friend Tommy stream the Yakuza games. I've seen one where he like fights a bear, but I don't know the name of the character. Me if I ever did Is that like stupid. a callback to the old Sounds Yakuza like game? Means a lot to you. Or something? Yeah, he does. I'm sure if you guys met Gramps... Because once we finish this, I'm starting Yakuza 3. Because that's next in order. Like I keep saying, I was playing these... This is the only one I'm playing out of order just because... And, uh, I really wanted to play this game. The poor man was pressured into being my chaperone. Do I miss out on like the right character attachment? At least, yeah, but I hope he's enjoying his stay at the same time, it's gonna be like cool going yeah, back. I hope so too. So I think it'd, it'd just be like I just as cool, you good, know. But I don't want my whole family. Because now it's like I'm gonna see all these, like I guess all I the characters that have been in all the games, and I'm gonna be like, oh, that's that character. Sure it's like the reverse of like if you kind of, I don't know. Yeah, would you get him for his seventy-seven? Smart I guess story, story wise, it's kind of like that thing you I guess I know right? what would and happen because this is like blood pressure? most recent, but at the It'll same time, if it detects any irregularities I think once I get to like those games, I'm not going to remember, you know, review. or like I don't know. I don't think it's ruining really. it for me. It's even got GPS, so I don't have to keep worrying about him. Say what? If he tries to spy and sneak up on me, I'll find out right away. <laughs> uh, that's a little cruel, ain't it? I feel bad for the old man. Yeah, maybe. Those his balls. Yeah. This is, gonna, this is like actually just going to be cutscenes. <laughs> it's gonna be like forty-five minutes of just cutscenes. But if it's like Tommy hey, Zawa's at the end, we do a fight, Shijana. but. Nah, of course not. We gotta do it for the achievement. What's up? And I mean, it's well, like giving us Gramps abilities. Tried so. to get in touch with me just now, saying, "I'm sure you're busy, but do you think we could still meet?" Right, the butler who works for your family. So go meet him. What the hell? Ever since I joined you guys, I haven't gone to visit him in a long time. He must be real worried about you, Chichon. Yeah, no kidding. You know what else he said? I believe Milady is hiding something from me. Uh. All I've told him was that I'm just enjoying my time abroad like a typical exchange student. I mean, you gotta hand it to the old man. His intuition's pretty sharp. <sighs> yeah. Milady. My instructor's gotta be the best of the best. Well, why don't you go visit him? Not only is he an instructor, he's but he's probably doing. also a physician. But if I do, he'll probably figure me out. You said it yourself, he's pretty sharp. And if he picks up that something's off, he's gonna have to report it to my family. Basically, nothing good will come from me seeing Gramps right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I should totally just have him um, join us. Put his mind at ease, though. You don't want him to keep worrying over you, right? Well, yeah. You've got a point. It's been kind of hard on him. You sure you want to leave him hanging like this? Wouldn't he try to look for you himself? I think he'll be fine. He's old and only just started using a smartphone. He doesn't know anyone <laughs> else in Hawaii, so he'd have a hard time trying to track me down on his own. But all that just means I'm free to do as I please now. He's reached a ripe old age. Actually, that doesn't make it any better, huh? In fact, he's probably even more lonely. He probably is. But I want to keep going like this just a bit longer. Why don't you try sending him something different from usual then? Uh, I don't follow. You guys have only been texts, right? Maybe you could add a video or a picture. Change it up. Hmm. Okay, then what do you suggest? TikTok dance. Group foe, yeah. You always send him a selfie with us too. Okay. But I always feel like, because wouldn't self, I mean, I guess that'd be like the right use of a selfie, but well, no, not at the same time. Because to me, when I hear selfie, it's like you taking a picture of yourself, you know? He'd probably give me the third degree, and I'd rather not make him any more worried, you know? Well, uh, even if you don't want to meet him, it 
probably couldn't hurt to show him at least something. Yeah, guess you're right. I'll sleep on it. <laughs> it's kind of funny in a way. My parents never gave a shit about me. Gramps was the only one who cared. Well... <laughs> Not all family are bound by blood, you know? Hearing you talk about your Gramps reminded me of that. I wasn't related to the man who raised me, Jiro Kasuga. He ran a soap land back in Kamrocho. We definitely had that. Is that really I say it, Kamrocho? At least I thought so. Ichiban. If there's even just one person out there who gave a shit about you, then wouldn't that make them family? Yeah. Guess so. <laughs> Thanks, Ichiban. What for? I don't know if Grams considers me family, but he's definitely important to me. He does deserve more than a wall of text, though. Uh, maybe I'll give him a call from time to time. <laughs> That's not a bad idea. Your suggestion's not so bad either. I think I will send him something a bit more real. Glad to hear it. That alone makes this all worthwhile. Thanks for the life lesson today. Okay. Combo attack, hell yeah. More talking. <laughs> what? Oh. Yo, Chichan. Something the matter? Oh, hey. Um, did you hear everything? No, didn't hear a thing. Oh, okay. Well, I was on the phone with Gramps, and apparently he heard a pretty disturbing rumor. Don't tell me it was about you. <laughs> yep. It's kind of old news now, but word got out that I got into District 5 by stealing someone's passport. I guess it's not yeah, so it was a yours. rumor, you know, since it's true. Someone's passport, you say? <laughs> I mean mine. It doesn't really matter who's... Uh, anyway... He yeah, it does. How I was looking for the Barracuda's hideout. But that stuff's all water under the bridge now. Can't you just tell him it was someone else? I did. But Gramps is still distraught because the young lady in the rumor sounds just like me. And now he won't believe a single word I say. Wait, hold up. How did your Gramps even hear about these rumors? I thought he didn't know anyone here in Hawaii. I probably underestimated him on that front. He's so polite. He can strike up a conversation with just about anyone. Before I knew it, he made himself a friend. Said Jeff told him all about the rumors. Jeff? Wait, Jeff? Who the hell's Jeff? Wait. As in taco guy Jeff? The one selling stolen oh, goods? That guy's name was Jeff. Yep, the very same. Grams loves his tacos so much, he's been getting them for lunch. Even though he knows that Jeff is kind of shady, he still enjoys talking to him. Well, damn, I... Former martial artist, a Fujinomiya butler, and a smooth talker at his age. I honestly didn't see this coming. Gramps is actually driving me into a corner. Yeah. We could try bringing him to our side. A former martial artist would make a great ally. <laughs> Get real. He's not at the age to be doing this kind of stuff. I mean, he's 77. Yeah, true. I just figured if he was one of us, he'd keep your secrets all hush-hush. Well, I doubt he's going to find me anytime soon, so I'm trying not to panic right now. Huh? Wait a sec. Aren't you worried he'll wind up in danger somehow? What do you mean? <laughs> he's going to go look at her. Rams heard that you went to District 5, right? But since you're not fessing up, what do you think he'll do next? I don't know. I'd make my way to District 5 so I could get to the bottom of this. What? Wait, what? Once I got my hands on some proof, I'd ask you to tell me the truth. But, but there's no way Grams could just wander into a place like that. You've got to steal a passport or find some dirty cop willing to get you in. Right, but your Gramps wouldn't know about any of that. He's just going to try his damnedest to trace your steps. And if there's some barracudas hanging around, 
Wait. I don't know if you'll come out entirely unscathed. Yeah, but for sure. I'm confused. Oh, well, crap. I better try calling him back. I have to tell him that if he's thinking about heading to District 5, don't. Like, probably best to keep an eye on him right now. Uh, it'd be pretty hard. Was she to telling him seven, though? She's yeah, not in no District kidding. of Five, but <laughs> God, at this rate, Gramps I thinks know who's she is. Over who. I feel you. I do feel bad about making Gramps worry so much, though. Because she's like <laughs> not telling him today, he's not in District of Five. I'm <laughs> Maybe because I am. This. Never thought there'd be a day where I'm the one worrying about him. <laughs> All of that just made me realize how much time has passed. <laughs> you better remember this feeling. Because in times like this, a good drink really hits the spot. <laughs> Didn't know that. Well, I don't think we could finish we'll the storyline because we still need our For last sure. damn thing. On the bingo card. I think that's what... Yeah, it's like we need one more. Struggles with. Not sure yet, that's the only one we need. Where's Bond? Oh, did it just get Bond? Wait, Bond level 59. Bond lock as story progressed. Oh my gosh, we're like literally being story locked out of playing the damn game. I mean, it makes sense, but. Oops. What are you staring at? Oh yeah, we're level 38s now. I've been grinding the dungeon. What do they call it? Hawaiian haunt? Yeah, this dungeon. Um, I almost completed the, like I almost fully completed it. Like I've done the sec first floor, second floor. I think I got halfway into the third floor. I think I just made it to the point where I could escape. It's like I halfway completed the third floor. Cause things are level 40 and it, it was uh it was getting kind of hard <laughs> but we're getting that xp in oh that's what, okay after we finish whatever this is the slake part of the uh we're gonna go back to the sujimon because i think we're high enough level so i think it was just level 30 we needed to be to finish all the sujimon and it was real freaks yeah. that kind of fun Oh, I missed like a super. I wish I was recording that too. I didn't know it was gonna be a whole cutscene thing, but I kept giving gifts to the Aloha Happy lady, and uh, yep, crazy stuff happened. Shit. <laughs> Highly recommend. Excuse me. Search on YouTube like like a dragon infinite wealth, Aloha Happy mm. quest line cutscenes or whatever something like that it got kind of crazy i think we banged the palm tree guy and the lady at the same time it's like basically what i think gonna happen all right that is his voice just tell us yeah. stuff we already know hmm? Oy. This beat us too. So I think we're like probably gonna be extremely over. Yeah, 22 and we're 38. What? So my one friend was making fun of me. It's like saying like level 38 in chapter six. But I'm just I'm just playing this damn game. Like I'm trying to do everything. Healing up. 
Wow. Uh oh, password. Fried dumplings from the mainland. I'm screenshot that with my phone. That's like a big time gamer secret, dude. Back in my day, we head over to the black hibiscus. Hibiscus and say fuck. Back in my day, playing N64, Dreamcast stuff. I didn't really play that much Dreamcast. PlayStation, original Xbox. You had to damn write things down. Hold on. Now you just take a picture of your phone. Actually, I mean for like a while now, you could take a picture of your phone. It's actually really funny. I found. I wish I kind of kept them, but I did throw them away, like last month or something. I should have kept them. I think I kept a couple. I found like a whole bunch of like cheat codes that I printed out from when I was a kid. I can't remember the games. I think I saved a couple of them just because it was like funny. From what was it? Is there's like Cheat Code Central or something? Was one of the. I think it was like cheat CC or something. I always remember, like, going, we'd print those out with like my friends this and then we just do crazy it. shit in games. That came out well. Oh, that's like not close. Oh, there. <laughs> I'm feeling good. What do you want? Hmm? Yeah, you like have to write stuff want? down. Jot it down real quick while you're playing a game. Should we need these for something? So when I was doing the level 40 dungeon shit, is uh, that's what I got most of the way through. But it's like a super grind. Like you have to actually like think about the things you're doing. And like so many of the battles were uh, like status effect things. I'll be fine. They took forever. Like it was like 15 minutes for battle. Not like I'm like such lower. Um, I'm a lower level than all of it, so it's like I have to think about stuff. Can't just do stuff. We're getting tons of keys from doing that. <laughs> really? Oh, is it because it's like there's a boss guy? Oh, we made him. Damn it. Yeah, this is awesome doing uh, like the drink link things because like all of them are we keep getting these like combo attacks. Whoa, we actually blocked it. Hell yeah. I was just spamming. I need these herbs for uh, one of the things to craft. Dude, that's good. We found them. Where do they want us to go? Oh, oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> We're at 29 minutes, so I mean, it'd take like two seconds to fast travel, but we'll do that and I'll start the new recording. So as always, thanks for watching. I really enjoyed it.